introduction, in a multi-part exploration of the enigmatic phenomenon surrounding the Trump presidency, we delve deeper into the intricate facets that form the essence of his fervent following. As we embark on part four of the Cult of Trump series, our focus shifts to a potent force that not only shaped the narrative, but also steered the course of policy and ideology, Christian nationalism. This installment scrutinizes the fusion of religious convictions and nationalist fervor, a blend that found a powerful foothold within the fervent base of Trump supporters. Join us as we unravel the layers of Christian nationalism, its historical roots, its symbiotic relationship with the Trump era, and its lasting impact on the American social and political landscape. As we explore this intricate interplay of faith and fervor, we aim to shed light on the complex web that ties Trumpism and Christian nationalism, unraveling the narratives that contributed to this unique and sometimes controversial alliance. Hey everybody, Ronnie here. I want to say thank you for watching. This video today is sponsored by, well, nobody. But let's go ahead and rectify that situation. Hit the subscribe button, give me a like, and throw a comment down to show YouTube that we're worth it. Now back to the video. Chapter 1, Understanding Christian Nationalism. At the heart of the intricate web of beliefs and ideologies lies the phenomenon known as Christian nationalism, a term that encapsulates the fusion of religious devotion with a fervent sense of national identity. To comprehend its significance within the context of the cult of Trump, it's essential to trace its historical origins and understand its defining characteristics. Historical Context Christian nationalism's roots trace back to the early days of the United States, when religious principles were interwoven with the very fabric of the nation's identity. Emerging from the Puritan settlers' vision of a city upon a hill, a society modeled on biblical principles, Christian nationalism gained momentum over the centuries. This narrative posited America as a chosen land, guided by divine providence, and forged a strong connection between faith and patriotism key beliefs and characteristics. At its core, Christian nationalism is marked by a belief in the indispensability of Christianity in shaping the nation's laws, culture, and policies. Adherents maintain that the nation's success hinges on its fidelity to Christian principles. This often translates into advocating for policies that align with conservative Christian values, such as opposition to abortion and support for traditional family structures. Additionally, Proponents emphasize the importance of religious symbols and practices within public spaces, viewing them as vital markers of America's spiritual heritage. Furthermore, Christian nationalism is characterized by a sense of moral superiority and a desire to maintain a particular cultural identity. It often seeks to challenge secularism's encroachment, advocating for religious liberties that align with its worldview. This movement sees itself as a defender of American exceptionalism, asserting that the nation's greatness is intrinsically linked to its religious foundations. Christian nationalism found a fertile ground within the realm of Trumpism due to shared values and mutual goals. During the Trump presidency, we witnessed a convergence of these ideologies as his administration catered to the aspirations of Christian nationalists. The Trump era saw a resurgence of discussions surrounding issues such as traditional family values, religious freedom, and conservative moral frameworks. This alignment extended to political alliances, with Christian nationalist leaders throwing their support behind Trump. His promise to appoint conservative judges, defend religious liberties, and champion anti-abortion causes resonated deeply with this demographic. This mutual reinforcement gave rise to a complex relationship that contributed to shaping policies and rhetoric during his tenure. As we navigate the intricate terrain of Christian nationalism's influence within the cult of Trump, it becomes evident that this ideological fusion played a pivotal role in the narrative of his presidency. Understanding this symbiotic relationship provides a crucial lens through which to view the broader implications for policy, society, and the ever-evolving dynamics of American politics. Chapter 2. The Intersection with Trumpism The alliance between Christian nationalism and Trumpism reveals a complex interplay that shaped both the political landscape and the fervent following of the 45th president of the United States. As we delve deeper into this intricate relationship, it becomes evident that shared values and mutual goals fueled the convergence of these ideologies. One of the central elements that solidified the connection between Christian nationalism and Trumpism was the alignment of shared values. Both movements emphasized a return to what they viewed as traditional family values, an opposition to abortion, and a staunch defense of conservative moral standards. These values, framed within the context of faith and nationalism, 
resonated strongly with supporters of both movements, creating a common ground that transcended political differences. Christian nationalist leaders rallied behind Trump's candidacy, viewing him as a champion of their causes. His promises to appoint conservative judges who would protect religious liberties and uphold Christian principles resonated deeply within this demographic. Trump's vocal anti-abortion stance, paired with his commitment to protecting religious freedom, cemented his appeal among Christian nationalist circles. This alignment extended beyond campaign rhetoric and translated into policy decisions. During his presidency, Trump embraced issues championed by Christian nationalists, such as advocating for religious exemptions in healthcare and taking a firm stance against LGBTQ rights. This dynamic interaction between the president and the Christian nationalist movement marked a significant chapter in the evolution of both spheres. The influence of Christian nationalism on Trumpism was manifest in policy initiatives and rhetorical narratives. Policies related to reproductive rights, LGBTQ rights, and religious freedom were often framed in ways that aligned with the values of Christian nationalism. These policies stirred fervent debates and positioned the president as a defender of conservative Christian principles. Moreover, the rhetoric used by Trump and his supporters frequently invoked religious imagery and terminology. Trump was often portrayed as a messianic figure chosen by God to lead the nation through troubled times. This blending of religious and political narratives further solidified the bond between Trumpism and Christian nationalism, positioning Trump as a symbolic embodiment of their shared aspirations. As we unravel the layers of this intricate relationship, it becomes evident that the intersection of Christian nationalism and Trumpism held immense sway over the discourse, policies, and identity of the Trump era. This intersection underscores the complexity of political movements and the ways in which shared values can shape the course of the presidency, leaving a lasting impact on the socio-political fabric of the nation. Chapter 3, Trump as a Messianic Figure Within the realm of Christian nationalism, the concept of Donald Trump as a messianic figure emerged, casting him as a chosen leader destined to fulfill a divine purpose. This perception, while not universally held, shed light on the extent to which faith and politics intertwined during his presidency. Supporters who saw Trump through a messianic lens often drew parallels between him and biblical figures. These comparisons, while symbolic, served to elevate Trump's status among some Christian nationalists. References to King David, Cyrus the Great, and even biblical prophets were invoked to align Trump with historical and spiritual figures who were chosen by God to accomplish significant tasks. This approach stemmed from a belief that Trump was uniquely equipped to champion Christian values and counter what some saw as a moral decline in society. This interpretation framed his actions and decisions as part of a divine plan, reinforcing the notion that his presidency was preordained. Theological justifications. The perception of Trump as a messianic figure was accompanied by theological justifications. Some Christian nationalists pointed to the idea that God often used flawed individuals to carry out his plans, drawing parallels between Trump's past and biblical stories of unlikely heroes. This narrative positioned Trump's personal history as a testament to divine redemption, allowing his supporters to reconcile his behavior with their religious beliefs. The notion of Trump as a chosen vessel for divine purposes also extended to policy matters. Policies aligned with Christian nationalist values were framed as part of a larger spiritual mission, further strengthening the connection between Trump's presidency and religious convictions. While this perception was not universally accepted among Trump's supporters, it significantly influenced the narrative surrounding his presidency. The idea of Trump as a messianic figure bolstered his appeal among some Christian nationalists, who felt that their spiritual convictions were validated by his leadership. It also deepened the emotional investment in his presidency, creating a sense of urgency to support him as a defender of faith. However, this perception also sparked debates and divisions within Christian communities. Critics argued that portraying a political figure as messianic risked blurring the lines between faith and politics, potentially compromising the core principles of religious devotion. In essence, the concept of Trump as a messianic figure illuminated the complex ways in which faith, politics, and personal beliefs converged during his presidency. It exemplified the extent to which charismatic leadership can intersect with deeply held spiritual convictions, shaping the narrative of Trumpism and Christian nationalism alike. Chapter 4, Impact on Policy and Society. The intertwining of Christian nationalism with the Trump era had profound implications for policy decisions and the broader societal landscape. The alignment of values and goals between these two movements played a pivotal role in shaping policies 
that continue to resonate within American discourse. Christian nationalism's influence on policy during the Trump presidency was particularly pronounced in areas that aligned with its core beliefs. The administration took a firm stance on issues like religious freedom, emphasizing protections for individuals and organizations that held conservative religious values. Executive orders and policies were implemented to safeguard these freedoms, often coinciding with the principles advocated by Christian nationalist leaders. Another arena of influence was the pro-life movement. Trump's anti-abortion stance and his appointment of conservative judges to federal courts were hailed as victories by Christian nationalists who championed traditional family values and the sanctity of life. This alignment was manifested in policies that aimed to limit access to abortion and curtail funding for organizations that supported abortion services. The impact of Christian nationalism on policy extended to LGBTQ plus rights, often leading to a clash between religious freedoms and LGBTQ plus equality. The Trump administration rolled back protections for transgender individuals, and there were attempts to allow religious exemptions that would enable businesses and individuals to refuse services to LGBTQ plus individuals on religious grounds. These policies reflected the tension between preserving religious convictions and promoting equal rights for marginalized groups. The influence of Christian nationalism on policy decisions also contributed to social polarization. Policies that resonated with Christian nationalist values often sparked intense debates, further dividing an already politically polarized nation. These debates brought issues of faith, morality, and national identity to the forefront of public discourse, fueling ideological clashes that extended beyond the political realm. While some Christian nationalists celebrated the impact of their influence on policy, others viewed it with caution. Critics argued that the emphasis on certain religious values at the expense of others could lead to the exclusion of diverse perspectives and marginalized groups. The strong alignment between Christian nationalism and Trumpism risked alienating those who did not share those specific values. In conclusion, the intersection of Christian nationalism with the Trump presidency left an indelible mark on policy decisions and societal attitudes. The fusion of religious convictions and political aspirations shaped key policy initiatives, sparked debates, and contributed to a landscape marked by both fervent support and fervent opposition. Understanding this impact provides insight into the dynamic interplay between faith-based movements and the broader sociopolitical context. Chapter 5, Case Studies and Examples. To comprehend the tangible influence of Christian nationalism within the realm of the Trump phenomenon, it's imperative to examine specific case studies and examples that vividly illustrate the dynamic interplay between faith, politics, and ideology. The Christian nationalist rallying cry, the 2020 Prayer March. One illustrative example is the Prayer March that took place in 2020. Organized by prominent Christian nationalist leaders, this event saw thousands of supporters gather in the heart of Washington, D.C. The march served as a public demonstration of the fusion between religious fervor and nationalistic pride. Participants fervently prayed for the nation's leaders and spiritual revival, while also echoing the Trump administration's conservative policy agenda, particularly on issues such as religious freedom and anti-abortion measures. This case study underscores the active participation of Christian nationalist figures in aligning religious convictions with political objectives. The Remaking America, the Supreme Court Appointments. The nomination and confirmation of Supreme Court justices during the Trump era provide another compelling case study. Christian nationalists viewed these appointments as a means to reshape the nation's judicial landscape in favor of conservative values. Trump's promise to nominate judges who upheld religious liberties and opposed abortion resonated deeply within this demographic. The appointments of justices such as Neil Gorsuch and Amy Coney E. Barrett were celebrated by Christian nationalists as milestones in their pursuit of protecting traditional family values and religious principles through the judicial system. The role of media and propaganda, Christian broadcasting, examining the media landscape offers insight into the propagation of Christian nationalist narratives. Christian broadcasting networks, such as Fox News and conservative radio shows, actively amplified the fusion of faith and politics. The symbiotic relationship between certain media outlets and Christian nationalism reinforced the idea of Trump as a chosen defender of faith. Notable figures within these outlets often showcase Christian nationalist leaders, giving them a platform to express their views and further solidify the connection between religious devotion and political loyalty. 
the Capitol Insurrection, a convergence of narratives. The events of January 6, 2021 stand as a stark example of how Christian nationalist narratives converged with the broader Trump movement. Some individuals who participated in the Capitol Insurrection framed their actions as part of a divine mission to restore the nation to its perceived religious foundations. Flags and symbols associated with both Christianity and nationalism were prominently displayed during the riot, highlighting the entwined ideologies that contributed to the unprecedented breach of the Capitol. In these case studies and examples, the fusion of Christian nationalism and Trumpism becomes palpable, offering insights into how religious convictions and political fervor intertwined to shape both individual actions and broader movements. These instances underscore the intricate ways in which faith and ideology intersect, leaving an enduring impact on the trajectory of American politics. Chapter 6, The Aftermath and Moving Forward As the Trump presidency came to a close, the influence of Christian nationalism on the political landscape evolved, prompting reflections on its future trajectory and its lasting impact on American society. The aftermath of the Trump presidency brought shifts in the dynamics of Christian nationalism. With the transition of power, some Christian nationalists faced the challenge of recalibrating their strategies and priorities. The end of the Trump era raised questions about how the movement would adapt its narratives and goals in the absence of its most prominent advocate within the highest office. The change in leadership also led to a nuanced reassessment of Christian nationalist rhetoric. Some voices within the movement began to emphasize themes of unity and reconciliation, seeking to bridge the gaps that had emerged during the polarized Trump era. This shift suggested a recognition of the divisive impact of the movement's alignment with political power. Furthermore, some Christian nationalist leaders expanded their focus beyond the realm of policy and politics, aiming to engage in broader social and cultural discussions. This diversification of interests revealed an attempt to exert influence beyond the confines of political institutions. While the immediate aftermath of the Trump presidency saw adjustments in Christian nationalist strategies, questions lingered about its influence on future political landscapes. Observers debated whether the movement's impact would continue to resonate within American politics, or if it would undergo further transformations in response to changing societal norms and priorities. Christian nationalism's intersection with Trumpism brought to the fore both its strengths and its vulnerabilities. Its ability to mobilize a passionate base and influence policy was evident, but the movement also faced criticism for perceived exclusivity and its potential to exacerbate divisions. The legacy of Christian nationalism's fusion with the cult of Trump raised significant questions about the role of faith in politics and the broader implications for the separation of church and state. The conversations sparked by this alignment are ongoing as scholars, theologians, and political analysts continue to dissect its impact, offering insights into the complex interplay of religious convictions and political ideologies in shaping the nation's course. As we consider the aftermath of the Trump era and the evolving narrative of Christian nationalism, we gain a glimpse into the evolving landscape of faith-based movements within American political discourse. The movement's future trajectory is intertwined with the broader evolution of societal values as it grapples with the challenges and opportunities presented in a changing world. Chapter 7 Voices and Perspectives A comprehensive understanding of Christian nationalism's impact within the cult of Trump necessitates a consideration of the diverse voices and perspectives that have shaped the discourse surrounding this phenomenon. A range of opinions, from advocates to critics, provides a multi-dimensional view of this intricate interplay between faith, nationalism, and politics. Christian nationalist leaders, prominent figures within the Christian nationalist movement have offered fervent support for the fusion of faith and politics. They emphasize the importance of upholding traditional Christian values within the framework of the nation's laws and policies. Advocates argue that a strong alignment between religious convictions and political power can contribute to the flourishing of a society built on moral foundations. Among Trump supporters, particularly those aligned with Christian nationalism, the perception of Trump as a defender of faith is fervently embraced. They view his policies and rhetoric as a means to safeguard religious freedoms and restore a perceived moral decline. These supporters argue that the convergence of faith and politics can lead to a more just and righteous society. Concerns about religious freedom. Some critics express concerns about the potential erosion of religious freedom for individuals and groups who do not adhere to Christian nationalist values. They argue that prioritizing one religious perspective within politics risks marginalizing others and infringing upon the separation of church and state. Erosion of pluralism. 
Critics also voice fears that the fusion of faith and politics can undermine the pluralistic nature of a diverse society. The dominance of a particular religious narrative within policy and discourse may exclude the perspectives of those who do not share those beliefs, leading to social divisions and exclusion. Ethical dilemmas. Skeptics point to ethical dilemmas that arise when a political figure is perceived as a messianic figure. They caution against the conflation of spiritual values with political actions, as this may blur the line between faith and ideology, potentially compromising the integrity of both. Complex dynamics. Scholars and analysts offer nuanced perspectives on the complex dynamics of Christian nationalism within the cult of Trump. They delve into historical, sociological, and theological dimensions, examining how this fusion has shaped American politics and society, as well as its implications for the future. Examining motivations, researchers seek to understand the motivations behind the fusion of faith and politics, exploring whether it arises primarily from deeply held beliefs or from strategic political calculations. Their insights shed light on the complex interplay of individual convictions and political maneuvering. In the confluence of these varied voices and perspectives, we uncover the rich tapestry of ideas and beliefs that surround the fusion of Christian nationalism and the cult of Trump. The discourse continues to evolve as societies engage in thoughtful conversations about the role of faith, nationalism, and politics in shaping the course of nations. Chapter 8, The Intersection of Christian Nationalism and White Nationalism, Unraveling Ideological Convergence. The intersection of Christian nationalism and white nationalism presents a complex and controversial confluence of ideologies within the social and political landscape. Both movements have deep historical roots and distinct objectives, yet they share certain elements that have led to their convergence in some circles. This essay aims to explore the intersection of these two ideologies, examining their historical origins, shared beliefs, and implications for contemporary society. Christian nationalism and white nationalism have distinct historical trajectories, but their origins intertwine in the context of racial and cultural identity. Christian nationalism emerged as a movement that sought to emphasize the role of Christianity in shaping a nation's identity and policies. On the other hand, white nationalism has roots in the idea of preserving and promoting the dominance of white culture, often emphasizing racial purity and supremacy. Despite their differences, Christian nationalism and white nationalism share some common themes that have contributed to their intersection. These include a sense of nostalgia for a perceived historical golden age, the desire to uphold traditional values, and a concern about cultural erosion. This convergence is particularly evident in the United States, where both movements have found resonance among certain groups. One notable point of convergence is the idea of preserving a specific cultural or religious identity. Some adherents of both ideologies may perceive Christianity and white culture as intertwined components of their national heritage. This perception can lead to the intertwining of religious and racial identities, resulting in a complex worldview that seeks to protect both religious and racial purity. The intersection of Christian nationalism and white nationalism raises significant ethical and social implications. While not all individuals who identify with one ideology necessarily subscribe to the other, their convergence in certain circles can contribute to the amplification of divisive narratives and ideologies. This convergence can further complicate discussions about immigration, multiculturalism, and social inclusivity. The blending of religious and racial identities also challenges the principles of religious pluralism and equality. This intersection can marginalize individuals and communities that do not fit into the mold of a particular religious or racial group. It can perpetuate exclusionary narratives that undermine the foundations of a diverse and inclusive society. Addressing the convergence of Christian nationalism and white nationalism requires a multifaceted approach. It begins with acknowledging the complex interplay between these ideologies while recognizing that not all adherents of one ideology share the beliefs of the other. Education and open dialogue are essential to fostering understanding and dismantling misconceptions about both movements. Furthermore, policymakers, community leaders, and religious institutions can play a crucial role in promoting inclusivity and challenging divisive narratives, encouraging discussions that emphasize shared values, empathy, and respect for diversity can help counteract the negative impacts of ideological convergence. The intersection of Christian nationalism and white nationalism reflects the intricate ways in which ideologies can converge, often driven by shared concerns about cultural preservation and identity. 
While these movements have distinct origins and objectives, their convergence can amplify divisive narratives and challenge the principles of a diverse and inclusive society. Addressing this convergence requires a comprehensive approach that promotes understanding, open dialogue, and a commitment to building bridges across ideological divides. By fostering greater awareness and empathy, society can work towards dismantling harmful narratives and promoting a more harmonious coexistence. Conclusion The intricate interplay of Christian nationalism and the cult of Trump has woven a compelling narrative that transcends the boundaries of faith, politics, and ideology. Through a thorough exploration of this fusion, we've unearthed the historical roots, examined its impact on policies and society, and delved into the complex dynamics that define this relationship. The narrative of Christian nationalism within the context of the Trump era is both a testament to the power of shared values and a reminder of the potential pitfalls of conflating faith with political power. As we've seen, Christian nationalism's alignment with Trumpism brought about both fervent support and vehement opposition. Advocates viewed the connection as a means to champion traditional Christian values within the political arena, applauding policies that aligned with their beliefs. Meanwhile, critics and skeptics expressed concerns about the erosion of religious freedom, the potential for exclusion of diverse perspectives, and the ethical implications of portraying a political figure as a messianic figure. Scholars and analysts contributed essential insights by studying the intricate dynamics of this fusion. They unraveled the motivations driving both the Christian nationalist movement and its alignment with Trumpism, painting a complex picture of intertwining convictions and strategic political considerations. In the aftermath of the Trump presidency, Christian nationalism's evolution remains an ongoing dialogue as its leaders and adherents navigate shifting dynamics and changing priorities. The intersection of faith and politics continues to shape discussions about the role of religion in shaping public policy and the broader societal landscape. The case studies and examples presented underscore how religious fervor can intersect with political aspirations, leading to both tangible policy outcomes and broader social division. This serves as a poignant reminder of the enduring power that faith and ideology wield in shaping the trajectory of nations. As we reflect on the fusion of Christian nationalism and the cult of Trump, we are reminded of the nuanced relationships that define political movements. This exploration underscores the necessity of critical inquiry, open dialogue, and an unwavering commitment to understanding the complex interplay between faith, nationalism, and politics in the journey of a nation. 